Hello, I'm reviewing Afro Samurai. Now, if you saw my unboxing, hold on, which no one really did because it was just a minor video I just put there, and then like uh, an hour later I put another video, so it was just a minor one just to throw it out there. Uh, if you saw it, then you know I got it, obviously. So, Afro Samurai, and you know that I said it's a movie. I didn't notice. It's not a movie. It's a five-part cartoon. Now, uh... It doesn't really matter to me because I, when I saw it on Amazon, it said the movie follows Afro Samurai on his quest to fight uh, justice, voiced by Ron Perlman, which you can really can't really tell because he talks like this. Uh, he doesn't talk like Hellboy, who he plays as. Uh, it's on his journey to fight justice, uh, who killed his father in a brutal way. He cuts his head off uh, back when he was younger. Uh, it follows him uh, on his adventure with his partner, uh, Ninja Ninja. Now, uh, Ninja Ninja is also voiced by, yeah, I didn't really mention this, uh, Afro Samurai is voiced by Samuel L. Jackson, but he also voices Ninja Ninja, so, uh, uh, yeah, Afro, Afro himself, he doesn't talk at all, really. He says maybe, like, two sentences worth of dialogue in this whole movie. I'm calling it a movie. It's a five-part cartoon, but... That's it. I don't know if there'll be like a season two kind of like thing. Maybe uh, Afro Samurai 2. It ended off like there could be. But they, this movie is violent. This movie is... Uh, you're probably going Afro Samurai. Yo, this has to be a joke. And it's Samuel L. Jackson. You're thinking, Motherfucker, I'll slice you! No, he, he's just... He's being cool. He's being cool. Okay, and it has the, a great anime style. It surprised me because I'm looking at this and I'm like, okay, obviously it's not really gonna look like that in the cartoon. I'm thinking like because it's not, it was, it wasn't really hyped up. It was actually, never mind. Uh, and there's actually a video game coming out, but it wasn't really uh, announced that much. It wasn't, and I never saw a commercial for it. All I heard was Samuel L. Jackson saying. Mom! He didn't say that either. Uh, and then I looked at this, and then, if you can't tell, he looks really fake in this. He looks terrible in that picture. I don't know why. Uh, he just didn't appeal to me in that picture. But this movie, I'm calling it a movie. I don't care. This movie is fun. It has a great story, even though sometimes it's a little weird. I don't care. Fun story. It's pretty much a. You could say it's Naruto. Except black people are actually in it. Uh, there's blood. Uh, there's cursing. There's sex. Well, there's a sex scene with Afro and this Chinese bitch. And there's also this. Uh, whatever. It's like a whore. But she doesn't take her clothes off, of course. Chinese bitch takes her clothes off, but the whore doesn't. Uh, but the Chinese bitch is hotter. I'm just saying. Weird. Uh, what was I saying? God damn it. Fucking whores. Always fucking whoring around. Being whores. I need a drink. Alright. Uh, anyway. Yeah, there's sex. Uh, what else is there besides... Naruto. Uh, Naruto has cartoonishness and ha ha, you'll never catch me. <laughs> no, Samurai's like, if someone says, yeah, Naruto would say, ha ha, you'll never catch me. <laughs> yeah, I'm getting stupid in this, so I'm just gonna say it's really good. Samuel Jackson does great. Ron Perlman does good, even though you only see him in like uh, the first cartoon for five minutes and the last cartoon for five minutes. It's a really fast-paced movie. And, uh, overall, if I had to give it a score out of my review system, I have to say it's really good. Go get it. It's fun. Four and a half Ninja Ninjas out of five. Thank you for watching this review. I hope you were entertained because I was very energetic today because I just got an ass load of DVDs, so I was like, awesome. Uh, thank you. Bye. Also... Uh, people, uh, say this a lot in my reviews, like, you don't even have a script, but the fuck am I doing, making a movie? I don't need a script for these short 
for reviews. If I'm making something like AVGN does, or my friend uh, Angry Movie Critic uh, does, he does like, at the end, he does pretty much what Angry Video Game does, pretty much does something related to the movie he's, or game he's doing, like, if you know Angry, my friend AMC, go check his move, reviews out, he's funny as hell, he's cool, uh, he's a cool guy, he, yeah, the asshole of DVDs, he told me over 400, go check him out, uh, he does, like, all that crap, like, uh, he reviewed Killer Condoms, at the end, Killer Condoms came and tried to kill him, he's, it's cool, uh, so yeah, well, uh, I don't have scripts like that, okay? Why? Because I'm not doing that kind of crap. Or I'm just saying, this review of movie, good. Oh. Okay, I'm not going, this movie was fantastic. Now go go over there and slice someone in half because it's Afro Samurai. No. No, I'm not going to do that. Anyway, I hope this isn't over ten minutes, by the way. Anyway, thank you. Four and a half Ninja Ninjas. That's right out of five. No, I'm still not going to do it. Bye.